one more aspect to this. A lot of people do talk about the oceans in terms of the oceans are mm. a carbon sink. They're a degraded carbon sink. They're not functioning properly. Um, can we green the oceans is one question. Should we green the oceans? If we do and we absorb loads of carbon dioxide, would that impact the price of carbon on the carbon drawdown? I mean, how would all of that... Is this any of this reasonable thinking? Um, well, it, it's reasonable, but it's, it's quite a long way further behind. Um, there are technologies that are, people are thinking about for um, removing carbon via, uh, from, from via mats of kelp, for instance, and the various plank and, and dealing with plankton. There are things that, that can probably be done, but um, whether they can be done, again, whether the technology can be developed fast enough is d difficult. And the fact also is that the technology depends on a knowledge of biology. The ocean, it's much more a question of understanding um, where the plankton is, how you can deal with it, um, how you affect the productivity of the ocean by what you do. When, when you're dealing with the air, it's, it's, it's more simple, it's physics, um, which is always more simple than biology. But with the oceans, you need to understand the biology. Uh, but it has been pointed out <laughs> that um, if, you, if you take carbon dioxide out of, directly out of the ocean by a similar method to, to doing it out of the air, it's cheaper, it's easier to get to remove the CO2 that's dissolved in the ocean than it is to remove it from the air. And it's something like $20 a ton. It's like it's, it can be done it, it more cheaply. Um, and what would happen is that the ocean and the atmosphere will rebalance themselves. So taking it out of the ocean is really as good as taking it out of the air uh, because the, 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 the ocean will then uh, absorb more of carbon dioxide out of the air so it's the same as taking it out of the air but psychologically it's not the same um, because if you if you're convinced which we are I guess that warming of the atmosphere is causing all these disasters then and we take the co2 out of the atmosphere we're bringing the atmosphere back to its pre-industrial level and everything will become better we will have a we will have a, a more moderate, moderate climate uh, but then n neglecting the air but taking it out of the ocean people will ask well what's the point of taking co2 out of the ocean i mean the fact is that most of the co2 is in the ocean and and it does it does rebalance but it's hard to get that across so psychologically i think the efforts will focus still on taking it out of the air even though that, that costs more, uh, because you're, you're then getting to the source of your, your climate warming, which is warmer air.